friends, it's Heather Casper from the Minnesota Marine Art Museum coming to you today from my kitchen to share a special artwork and a pretty silly poem. This painting was painted by an American artist named Mary Cassatt. The title of the painting is Francoise sitting in a round back chair reading. And that's a good title because this is in fact a little girl named Francoise and she is sitting in a chair with a round back and she's reading a large blue book. If you look closely at her eyes, you may see she's not really reading. It looks like she's probably thinking. I wonder what she's thinking about. It looks like she's reading this book indoors. So maybe she's thinking about going outside. Or maybe she's thinking about something she just learned in the book. Or maybe she's thinking about something really important, like her nose. This poem is called, Be Glad Your Nose Is On Your Face. And it was written by Jack Prolutsky. Be glad your nose is on your face, not pasted on some other place. For if it were not, you might dislike your nose a lot. Imagine if your precious nose were sandwiched in between your toes. That would clearly not be a treat, for you'd be forced to smell your feet. Your nose would be a source of dread were it attached atop your head. It would soon drive you to despair, forever tickled by your hair. Within your ear, your nose would be an absolute catastrophe. For when you were obliged to sneeze, your brain would rattle from the breeze. Your nose instead, through thick and thin, remains between your eyes and chin, not pasted on some other place. Be glad your nose is on your face. Thanks for listening to that poem and by looking and, and for looking at this artwork by Mary Cassatt with me. I hope to see you guys really soon in the galleries at the museum. Bye for now.